Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Darren Cabral. I'm the CEO of Suit Social. We're a digital marketing agency that helps companies build their brand, generate more leads, and get more sales online through digital advertising, specifically Facebook ads, Google ads, all that fun stuff. And today we are talking about a big part of that, which is landing pages. What are landing pages? Landing pages are the page you build that you wanna send traffic to, to accomplish some sort of objective. It could be to sell a product, it could be to download a free resource. There's all kinds of landing pages for all kinds of reasons, but basically it's a dedicated page that you're gonna send traffic to, to get people to take some sort of action. The reason why landing pages are important is because they let you focus down on a specific outcome. Your website has a lot of distractions, a lot of options, a lot of things people can go through, and it's not always best to just send traffic to your homepage, right? That's not always the right move. Sometimes you need to really specialize, niche down, what's your offer, what's the thing you're trying to sell, and just have a page focused on accomplishing that objective. That way you have the highest possible conversion rates because we all know that Landing pages in general have a much higher conversion rate than a general website. And it's also to just be able to track the outcome of a lot of your marketing. Sometimes having landing pages just helps you understand what things are coming from. If you have a landing page just for your Facebook ads, any sales that come through that or any leads that come through that, you know exactly where they're coming from. So it helps you narrow down. That's one of the big benefits. The thing with landing pages are there's a lot of ways to go about building them. So if you wanna build a good landing page, you have a few options. Firstly, you can build it right on your website. So if you use something like WordPress or Wix, there's a lot of options to make a dedicated landing page. One of the core attributes is usually that it's a dedicated page, meaning you don't have a full navigation up top, you're focusing on one thing. There's a clear headline, maybe a video, an offer. It's just that one thing. There's not gonna be an opportunity for people to click around. You can do that, like I said, on just about any platform. Now there's some that stand out. So there's platforms like ClickFunnels, which have been built specifically to create landing pages. These things have been created to basically make you really good landing pages that just do one thing really good, which is convert traffic into a conversion, whether that's a lead or a sale. Now let's talk about some of the elements besides where you're building it that can help you make a good landing page that actually converts. There's a few key elements to what make a good landing page great and make it convert as many visitors as possible. So firstly, besides having a clear, concise page focus on one thing, you're gonna wanna make sure it's brand consistent, right? Your branding, your colors, your logos, your font should all match the core business. It shouldn't feel like a completely separate entity. It should blend with the rest of your brand. That way, as people are doing the research and they're checking your social, they're checking your website, everything seems legit. It doesn't seem like a random scam page that they're just gonna bounce from. The other thing with landing pages is keep your message clear, simple, and keep it right up top. As soon as I land the landing page, I should know exactly what I'm there for. I shouldn't have to scroll down for 30 seconds to figure out what you want me to do. Keep your primary message up top, whether it's with a video, a photo, text, a big headline, whatever it is, make it clear up top. The second key element of making a very good landing page that's gonna convert visitors is include social proof. Testimonials, reviews, whether in video format or written format are very important to help people understand what they're getting is actually legit. It's actually gonna work, other people enjoy it. It's a big part of having a high converting page. One of the last elements is your calls to action. Your calls to action are what you want people to do next. Usually, this is symbolized with some sort of button. They're either clicking a button that takes them to a form or they're scrolling down to a form, filling that out and clicking a button. An important thing about buttons is the color. There's been a lot of science, a lot of research on conversion that basically states there's a few colors for buttons that do exponentially better than anything else. You don't wanna use you know, a purple button just because that's the color of your logo um, or just a gray button because it looks modern and clean. You wanna study the colors and some of those that really pop are reds, oranges, yellows, and even greens. These are all high converting colors that you're gonna to wanna to incorporate in your landing page, especially in your button and in your call to action. On the note of call to action, another key element you wanna keep in mind is a clear call to action. Whatever you want them to do, make sure it's clear. Don't have a whole sentence or a paragraph. It's either download now, submit this form, or opt in to learn more. Whatever the call to action is, make it clear, make it simple, make it concise. So after hearing all these tips and understanding a little bit more about how you can create a high converting landing page, you might be thinking, what if I don't want to? What if you don't wanna create a landing page? What if you don't have time to create a landing page? What if you don't know how and you just don't wanna go through the whole process? If you're building a landing page for the purpose of, let's say, lead generation, you want someone to maybe download a lead magnet, a resource guide, or even just book a call, there are other options. The other thing you can do is every single platform, whether it's Facebook ads, LinkedIn ads, even TikTok ads, they all have what are called lead forms. This is a system that allows you to run advertising without having a dedicated page to send traffic to. And basically what it does is very simple. When you run an ad, and in your ad, let's say you're saying download our free book, when someone clicks that ad, the ad itself flips around and opens up as a built-in form right on the social media platform. And you can customize that where people can basically read the headline, description, and put in whatever information you need, name, number, email, 
all that fun stuff and collect it right on the platform, whether that's Facebook or TikTok or whatever, you can use lead forms without ever sending people off of social media or onto another page. That saves you time, saves you money. They also tend to convert actually a lot better in terms of volume. The only downside to lead forms, because they're easier, they're quicker, people convert more through them, you get more volume. The only downside is usually quality. The quality of leads is a little bit lower because there's less resistance. Anyone can just click through. A lot of cases, their information auto-populates. If they're on Facebook, it'll automatically put their name and everything in for them. And sometimes the wrong email goes in or the wrong number goes in, and that can be a problem. But I personally think the convenience outweighs the, the cons here, and I'm a big fan of lead forms, especially for service-based companies. If you don't have a fantastic website, you don't already have a web developer, you don't wanna waste the time and money, like I said, lead forms are an incredible other option, specifically for running paid advertising campaigns, and they're available. So if you're on the fence and you've been a service company specifically that's wanted to run advertising, and you're just being held back because you're like, I don't have time to make a landing page, or I don't wanna do that, or I don't have a nice website, don't worry, we can run an entire advertising funnel without even ever building a landing page and you'll still get a great result. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to drop a like, share it with a friend, or if you have questions, agree or disagree, drop it a comment, we'd love to hear it. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. We drop new videos every single Friday. We'll see you on the next one.